Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we've stumbled on uh, quite the gem. We found a whole street, a whole cul-de-sac of abandoned houses. And there's the first one. I'm gonna see if we can get inside now. We're gonna wear masks because the, the type of house that it is, the age of it, they might be, they might have been abandoned because there's asbestos present. So we're gonna take a look around now, this first house and then head, uh, head towards the other ones. It's actually pretty ruined. Might be some good shots though. So it's a whole cul-de-sac full of abandoned houses, guys. It's pretty awesome. So as you can see, this is quite a lot of mess around. Lots of damage, lots of things being pulled around the place. You see something interesting there? Just the 2010 on the data. Oh, yeah. Let's go direct. Oh, yeah, there, 2010. It's so, like it's been eaten by something. <laughs> so that gives us some indication. We don't know, there could be people lurking in here, we don't know. Oh, check this out. The chair sitting there in front of the TV. Look at the cross. <laughs> yeah, it is. The cross on the wall there. Nice big window. James broken. No, I don't see that. Yeah, you do. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not sure how safe it's going to be upstairs, considering half the, the floors fell down. And there's a, this is the front door of the place, I think. Well, don't know if there's two front doors. That wasn't the area. Yeah, maybe. Oh, this is, this is cool, I'm loving this because I get the feeling other people haven't been here. Oh yeah, that's a good point, yeah. One of the most common finds in exploring. Tacky fireplaces. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> and you've got to take a photo of it. It's got to be done. It looks looks like we had a arcade floor. It's all been ripped up. Maybe we've got nature making its way back inside the house. We look through this window here, we're getting a glimpse of the other houses. All of those are abandoned. I don't know, I don't know if it's safe. I'll, uh, I'll give it a go anyway. If, like, if you look, see how the, the bottom's gone, but the floorboards are still there. Yeah. So it should be solid. we to make our way upstairs. There's a lot of plaster hanging about, and a lot of things been broken. Yeah, it's pretty trashed, isn't it? So to our left we have what I think is probably the, the bathroom. Insulation. And there's that big window. That big window showing our presence to the world. I don't want to get out this window. <laughs> anything about I don't really want to go over where these holes in the floor are, so we'll just stick the head around the corner. Just the toilet that way, right? Yeah. Oh god, yeah, let me think of that. So let's have a look in here. Junk, this place has been proper trashed, hasn't it? Strange. Yeah, this is just loft insulation. I don't know why anyone would rip it out. Yeah. I mean, look at all the... There's a lot of stuff left behind as well, hasn't there? Like, if you think if 
place was moved out of because it was unsafe to live in. You'd think they'd take their shit with them. Mm. Wouldn't you? Yes. You alright, babe? Yeah. Finding it minging. Yeah. So I'm kind of um, going around a bit quicker than normal because we've got so many houses to hit. We just what? Oh yeah, a pub to visit, not to to uh, a pub to explore, not to have a dinner at. <laughs> <laughs> so that's house number one of I think about four or five, if not more. And does it feel creepy, huh? Does. So, I'm gonna come back in anyway. so this this might be a potential for the um for some paranormal investigation as well because Ree's um she's better than her she's better than a k2 meter she just has a feel for it so i'm gonna head over to these other ones now should be able to get over the fence easily see it in there yeah we're gonna head into the next one now still keeping our masks on sorry if it's muffled Yeah. Oh, That's it. Anything behind door number one? Right. So in the living room of the first house, and it's empty. It's not trash. It's just old and abandoned, isn't it? People could definitely doss in here. Yeah, it's just kind of gross, that's all. Not what I expected. Just the pantry there. Right, off we go. Funny shape landing. Not the way the doors are. Cloud. Here in cupboard. Nothing in here. These are all empty, aren't they? Cute old fashioned wallpaper. Yeah. Good storage, eh? Yeah. <laughs> we love a bit of storage. <laughs> oh god, can't get in there. Shame, can't know what's in there. So guys, you wanna give us if you wanna give us your thoughts on what you think of these places so far? This abandoned street. First abandoned street we've ever found. Please, uh, please do so in the comment section. Some of the doors are shut. Oh yeah, that one's locked. I would only need them. Um, you know the square shape. It would only need the square shape to open it. Yeah, there's one here, we can, might be able to use this. Yeah, there we go. So this is the bathroom. My bathroom's been ripped out. Oh, it's a bit dodgy. I hope the lights are coming through. Look at the little ball out there. Killer whales and, and dolphins, although. Oh, look, there's a nest. I was about to say, I'll get back to that door. There's a nest, there's eggs in it. See that? It's awesome, isn't it? Oh. Um, yeah, so, that, that thing with the clip. That, that. <laughs> 
that thing with the killer whales and the dolphins. The killer whales would be trying to eat the dolphins if that was real. Just saying. Right, let's go next door. What's behind door number two? Yeah. Yeah, with, with your dance floor, stairs low, it's definitely a council thing, isn't it? Ooh, it's a bit nervy, wondering what's behind the door, so I always wonder what it might be. Oh, look, the coal, coal shed inside. <laughs> yeah. It's going to be at least 10 years, isn't it? Shit. <laughs> Yeah. Um, we've just been in here. Oh yeah. That was from there. Right, okay, so this is house number two. Okay. Now on to house number two. <laughs> <laughs> what is that? If you are even house number two. So now we're downstairs low. The coal shed. Yeah, this is different, it's got different decoration. It's got, oh, disgusting red. Not my taste, I'm making sure some people like red in their kitchen. Do you? Yeah. It's an angry colour, isn't it? You need, you need calming colours in the kitchen. <laughs> it's my domain. So this is, I think this is quite a gem, isn't it, we found here? Hopefully it's a gem that we found. It's, a, it's not something we've encountered before. It's a little cul-de-sac. Although there seems to be going through. Maybe it's some kind of assisted living. No, that's just the way we come in, isn't it? Yeah, it must. So, so these houses are all linked. So like, maybe it's assisted living, yeah. Or was. Then he all died of um asbestos poisoning. <laughs> it's not funny, it's not a laughing matter. <laughs> What's what? I think it's out of a washing machine or something. Or a dryer. What? Oh, what the Hoover? Look how cute it is. What? You skied. Door, house number three ish, I guess. Four. Behind door number four. I think it's you taking my photos. I think. You know when you hold the shop button down? Houses. I can't figure out at all. But it, was, it is a cool find, I think. Personal effects they want would be good. Oh, 
was another bird's nest here. <laughs> it has to be because it was closed. That, that bird's nest, isn't it amazing? A bird's nest, if you think about it, the way a simple creature like a bird can do that, can build that. No, they just they just destroy them. We've got we've got um love birds, too many of them. <laughs> and they make a racket. But they do have pretty kooky personalities and we're all about kooky in our household. Aren't we babe? Yeah. Another, another bedroom. Good condition. Yes. The nest somewhere then? Don't know. It was a reference to it. Yeah. Oh. See, they're like three Just another trash room. Shame, really. The next house. Another coal shed, another downstairs toilet. Hopefully, there's interesting stuff about that door that's locked. Can't get into that one. Intriguing, isn't it? What's going on with these houses? And they're in the middle of nowhere as well. It's next to like a, a rural main road, I'd say it was. Why is it here? Why are houses here? So we're finishing up here now. That was the abandoned cul de sac. I thought it was great. There wasn't lots of interesting things inside the houses, they were gutted or destroyed. Just the fact that it's here itself. Um, with nothing else around, it's pretty cool. Please let us know what you thought in the comment section. Any ideas why they were abandoned? Do you think maybe it was asbestos or something like that? And if uh, if you liked the video, please leave a like. If you're new and you want to see more videos like this and also paranormal investigation, please subscribe. And if you are subscribed and you want to make sure you don't miss any videos from us, make sure you hit the notification bell. Okay, so thanks for watching and see you again soon.